fellow Toolsmasters, in this room, who speaks English? Me? <laughs> Do you think English needs to change? I think yes. What's wrong with the English alphabet? It's inefficient. Letters are ambiguous, which means they can mean two different things. It should change. That guy's me. Here's the Korean alphabet. Most of you understand this. Is there any problem with the Korean alphabet? No. Because each letter only has one sound. Somebody thought ahead. You guys get points. Here's the English alphabet. We all know this. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Can you see any problems here? Um, the offenders. C, Q, and X. These letters, you give me a don't need. Uh. <laughs> First one, C. What's wrong with C? Oh. <laughs> For instance, the word cat can be spelled K-A-T. It's fine. Sight can be spelled S-I-T. Some words use C and K. A condescending. Just replace a C with a K or the C and an S. But we don't really need C in English. Next one, Q. This is a dumb letter. We don't need it. Quit can be spelled with a K and W. Clap, K K and W again. Q can be spelled like that. Queen, like that. Next one, X. All it is is K and S or Z. This is the sound that X makes. Wax can be spelled W A K S. Xylophone, just replace it with a Z. Ooh, two X's. Xerox, Z and then K S. This is a good idea. Now, abolishing letters has been done in other languages. Russian eliminated these like these. 100 years ago. Oh, well, here's one, Korean. <laughs> Korean eliminated these letters. <gasps> you guys already did this! <laughs> <laughs> the precedence has been set. Who remembers? What sound do these letters make? This is your language. <laughs> Nobody knows. <laughs> You weren't taught this in school. So the previous letters, C, Q, and Z, not Z, X, we don't need them in English. However, the English alphabet could use new letters with, with uh, these sounds here. Ch, in, ch, th. In Spanish, ch has its own letter in the alphabet. Russian gives it this, this symbol here. This is a ch sound. New letter, ch. <laughs> it combines C and H, but it doesn't give that sound. Consider the words change, chore, church, or chocolate. In Korean, you have this symbol here. That's good. You guys are thinking this is, this is good. <laughs> Next letter, in. in. Mm. Korean, your symbol is this here. Mm -hmm. English, you have to put a G at the end of it, but it doesn't give the, the same sound. I am seen him running and sweating. Someone who doesn't know English might pronounce these two letters out loud. In good. No, it doesn't work like that. Third letter, sh. Korean makes the same mistake. You use this symbol for s and sh. Minus one. 
<laughs> Russian or that Cyrillic uses a, this symbol here. This means shit. At bonus points. Shelly says she sells seashells down by the uh, seashore. It's hard to say, but it's not the same sound as a sip. New letter, th. I've discovered certain language speakers have a hard time saying this. Germans. It doesn't exist in the German language. Koreans, too, have a hard time. Here's something interesting. This symbol used to exist in our alphabet. Right there. Yet it looks like a P. Theodore thinks the three thin thumbs are thicker than Thor's form. <laughs> Should be written like that. However, a problem could arise if you see this word there. <laughs> Oops. If you do a search online, what comes up? Here's the revised English alphabet that I want. A, B, ch, <laughs> H, I, J, K, M, N, 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 Q, R, S, sh, T, Th, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, it's not done. More problems arise. Do you think Kareem could use some more letters? Yes. Yes, Korean could use more, much more letters. <clears throat> and though it's a problem with these B letters, F, L, Th, V, and Z. Example, fork. It's a, a spelled like that. Fork. But then if you translate it back, it says pork. Oh. I go to a restaurant. I say I want a fork, and they give me pork. <laughs> <laughs> Read, turns to that, and then translate back, it says read. Oh, thanks, guys. Thinking is this, turns into sinking. <laughs> what are you thinking about? <laughs> vice, turns into this, and then you get vice. My last name. This happens a lot. I turn into Mark Jink. <laughs> 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 A lot of inappropriate jokes. Korean badly needs different symbols for these two letters. When a Korean will say a word, like today's word of the day, I'm not sure what they're actually saying. For rebel. Rebel. Okay. Yeah. For instance, this word here, what's it, what does that say? Like. Really? Right. 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 This is a character from a game. Mega Man. Doctor. Correct. What? Like. So, so which is his name? In the instruction manual, it says two things. It says this, and it says that. Because there's no correct way to translate. Mm -hmm. Japanese and Korean, there's not a way to translate between R and F. Gets worse. Koreans need distinctive sound symbols for Tim and T. Mm -hmm. You write them both as that. Minus point. It happens again with Bean and Din. Bean and Din. Mean and Min. Sin and Sin. When I read Korean, sometimes I'm not sure, how should I pronounce this? It's not obvious. Here's my personal favorite. This symbol here. How should I read it? <laughs> rip, reap, rip, lip, leap, rip, leap. <laughs> There's seven ways to say this here. Perhaps Korean's not so perfect. Korean has more problems. <laughs> Sheets. If you spell this with your alphabet, Sheets. like that, you use the same symbol three times, but you're saying three different sounds. And then it turns into that. Is. You write it like this. 
contribute to that. Kids. Kit. You've got no F sound or fifth sound. It turns into this. Pips. That's not what I'm saying. Ooh. Every language has to change. English has to change. Korean should change. <laughs> Spanish is getting on the ball. Russian surprisingly has a right. I did not see that. If something is inconvenient, or fixed or added, do it. It may be inconvenient for us, but the next generation will thank us. English has been revised. Thank you. Oh.